Hey, this is Kelsey, not Chelsea, not live. I am Kelsey, and today I'm gonna show you the teeny tiniest little makeup kit you ever did see. So if you are anything like me, then you've got plenty of little teeny tiny pieces of makeup, usually from sample subscription boxes that you get every month that you really don't know how else to use. So I have decided to repurpose this awesome little tin as my very smallest full face of makeup kit. So to make my little teeny tiny makeup kit, I'm gonna start with this tin that used to house four of these incredible Bite lipsticks over the holiday season. The good thing about this one that was made by Bite is that it already has a mirror in the top. So if you don't have one of these specific tins, you can always try to DIY one yourself out of an old Altoids tin. So the first thing that is the must have in my little teeny tiny makeup kit is a fantastic lip shade. Now for me, I need something that is neutral, something that I know is going to last all day, and something that does have a pop of color. So this is just the perfect shade for me. It's just slightly rosier than neutral, but it is the perfect pick me up to a dull skin day. If like me, you have the occasional breakout, then you're gonna want something to correct your skin color. I'm gonna use this Boo Boo concealer that I received in my Ipsy bag in the month of March, but you can use any small sample size that you might have of some sort of neutral skin color corrector. I cannot put on a face without a little bit of blush, so I'm gonna need something to perk up my cheeks. This is the small sample size of the Benetint by Benefit. It is a lip and cheek stain, so it could also serve double duty as a little bit of a bold color choice on your lips. But this is a fantastic stain that blends out really nicely and creates a nice pink blush. To keep your eyelids from looking too neutral, I'm using this 5-in-1 Bare Minerals Primer and Eyeshadow. It is in this really great grayish color and it helps your eyelids to have a little bit of definition and it blends really easily just with your fingertips. You're going to want to finish your look with some sort of mascara and almost every company sends samples out on the regular. This is Makeup Forever Smoky Extravagant Mascara. It's a true black formula with a really nice conical brush. This brush size is perfect because it helps you get the little teeny tiny lashes in the corner and also the long sweeping motion that you need for a good curl. So believe it or not, these five products are really all it takes to help me feel just a little bit more put together. And they all fit inside this awesome little tin. If you have a bunch of sample size makeup lying around, you'd be surprised how much of it can fit into something as small as this. When your makeup kit is this tiny, then there's absolutely no reason to not carry it with you even in the tiniest of purses. So I've gotta know, what little tiny makeup would you make sure is in your tiny makeup kit? Be sure to let me know in the comments down below, and if you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. I am Kelsey Mackey, and I will see you next time. Bye. And when I first started writing my book, I was writing it for them. I was writing it so that people, young people, I wrote it because I don't think that anybody should feel alone.